Hello. In today's class, we are going to discuss few things about electric dipole. So we always know that electric dipole is nothing but which consists of a two charges, okay? And it is opposite in magnitude, and there is a something distance is there, which is a less distance in between that. That becomes electric dipole. So we have lot of uh, molecules, uh, maybe HCl. Maybe hydrogen fluoride like that other molecules are there those are those are nothing but dipoles acts as if like a dipole only okay positive charge and negative charge now always there is a question why that electric dipole moment is in always in the direction of negative to positive okay so that is a question so I am going to discuss I am going to tell you mathematically why and how that electric dipole moment is always negative to positive now dipole moment is nothing but it is a vector quantity we will denote in the letter of p which is equal to any charge the magnitude of any charge and the distance between them and the distance between the two charges now why it is uh, always negative to positive that we have to check right so two scenarios I am going to take. So case one I am going to take and case two I am going to take. In that we are not going to consider the dipole in x, y, z direction. So though we are going to consider x, y, z. Okay. So I am going to consider the dipole here in this distance. The distance between them is 2a. Okay. And say this is minus q this is plus q this distance is x now electric dipole moment of this system okay with respect to the origin how i can write down the total dipole moment is nothing but the vectorial sum okay which is equal to the moment of a negative charge with respect to this plus the moment of positive charge with respect to this that is 2a plus x so which direction it is i which direction it is in x direction no okay so now we can write down that minus qx my plus 2a q plus x into q all are in i direction so this just cancels I can write down 2aq in x direction so x direction if you see means positive x direction so positive direction in this method it is negative to positive charge dipole moment is negative to positive charge meanwhile go through this so another scenario that is x z and y so at the first what I have kept here the negative charge I have kept here now I am going to take positive charge here, negative charge this way 2a is the distance x is the distance so total moment of I can calculate total moment I can calculate is qx in x direction minus 2a plus x because the minus charge 2a plus x qi so if you substitute means qx i cap minus 2aq minus xqi so i so what happens this cancels you are going to get minus 2aq i cap or else you can write down 2aq minus i cap so what is minus i cap minus i cap means negative to or in the opposite direction of the x axis that is negative to positive so hence we will conclude that the dipole moment the dipole moment is always negative charge minus q2 plus q this is the mathematical expression so this is what uh, today you have discussed kindly subscribe and like the videos thank you